Hi, what's up? And in this video, I'm going to show you the cost of living in Norway. And it's going to be the average cost of actually living in Norway. I have been living as a foreigner in Norway for six years. And I will say that this budget I'm going to show you in this video is an average budget, a realistic budget, a real cost of living that we are actually living by right now. So I know there is a lot of opinions about the cost of living in Norway on Facebook groups and in social media, but you can believe this because this is an actual budget that we use right now. I will say that, of course, the cost of living does depend on where you want to settle in Norway. If you want to live in the bigger cities, cost of living will be more expensive. So let me just dive into how much it costs for us as a family of four to actually live in Norway. Let's dive in. By the way, my name is Sarah and as I said, I have been living in Norway for six years as a foreigner and on this channel I am sharing information about life in Norway in general, living in Norway and not least how you can get a job in Norway so you can move here and get a really nice life here. So if you are interested in all of this information, make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell so you'll get notified whenever I post a new video. And that being said, let's just move on with this video. Let me just walk through our fixed expenses, monthly expenses here in Norway. So this is the costs of living every month in Norway. And I'm really excited to share this with you because a lot of you guys have been asking me about what it actually costs to live here. So this is this is what you can expect. And we are not expensive livers we are totally average on what we use every month so let's start with i which with what i pay on the car i pay 1750 kroners norwegian kroners for the car each month and i do this for eight years and then for insurance for the car i pay 972 norwegian kroners i have to have the most expensive insurance on the car since it is a uh, loan but other other than that I really um, this is really average for the insurance a month um, it really depends on if you have done any damage and um, so how many years have you been uh, driving without doing any damage without using your insurance that's really what it comes down to then of course you also have to maintain this car and that um, for that I put aside 300 Norwegian kroners each month so this should cover um, the every second year you have to get it checked uh, this is something that the law has required it's for tires it's for service um, service is not something you have to do but it's really recommended so for that 300 for maintenance of the car and then for electricity here in Norway this has gotten really really expensive um, for the past um, year, I'd say, um, or ha uh, six months, this has gotten really, really expensive. So I'm not. Um, so I actually have to add 500 Norwegian kroners to this budget. But right now, it's 2,000 Norwegian kroners um, each month. And for municipality fees, this is all in these 2,000 Norwegian kroners. So moving on for what it costs to have our kids in kindergarten. We have one kid in kindergarten. Um, she is there every day from seven till uh, four and we pay 1,600 Norwegian kroners for that each month. This is of course divided on two. So um, this is, we are two, so two people. <laughs> so um, this amount is double if you are living alone, of course. And this amount is double if you live alone. The other ones yeah, is per person. Then I have Spotify, which is also uh, something we both pay. So you can double this amount if you are alone, 75 Norwegian kroners. Then we have some insurance um, for if we get robbed, that's 60 kroners each month. Um, <clears throat> And then for food, 
we pay um, and we have to add another 500 on that but we pay both of us pay 3,000 Norwegian kroners each month for this so I mean that's 70 that's 7,000 Norwegian kroners if you um, double this amount but we are two people right so I mean you can this is I think this is pretty average for food each month um, if you're just one person so um, food on the job I have 400 Norwegian kroners um, and then for the dentist I put aside 500 Norwegian kroners each month I get checked every year and for when when you just have your teeth checked here that is like 1200 Norwegian kroners so that's by my opinion pretty expensive um, but yeah so and then of course we buy presents for our friends and family uh, we put aside 550 Norwegian kroners for that and then just for you know clothing and things I need I put aside 2,000 Norwegian kroners each month I don't know if this is a lot um, but please let me know in the comments what you think about this amount but this is what I put aside so this will depend on you as a person and then of course on the house um, we put aside uh, 12,000 Norwegian kroners for the house that we are uh, building but if we were uh, in a house that we had a house loan on this 12,000 uh, kroners a month is pretty normal if you have a house that is like uh, two to three millions um, Norwegian kroners so this is what we put aside for that then I also put aside for a house in Denmark uh, this is really important to me since I am a foreigner that we get a house in my original country um, and then we are saving up money for our chil ch a child <laughs> now we have two so we actually have to double that amount um, and then I also save up money for for when I retire. Um, of course, I am getting automatically uh, retiring money from my job. So this is actually just, this is actually something I would not, I don't have to do, but I just do it. Then I also put aside some 400 Norwegian kroners for traveling to Denmark. Uh, this is also something that costs a lot of money. So I have to put this aside for that. So all together guys I am paying 28 and 593,000 kroners Norwegian kroners and this is I think this is pretty average um, so I mean it all depends on you as a person it depends on where you live and if you have a car if you um, have a partner or not and stuff like that so of course if you have a partner you can divide uh, insurance and some things maybe food also is a little bit uh, cheaper but overall I think 20 to 30 thousand Norwegian kroners a month is pretty normal here in Norway depending on what house you have and what kind of life you are living and how much money you have to put aside for savings all this kind of stuff but now you know um, what we actually use each month so as an average family so this is what you can expect if you have any questions about costs of living in Norway please let me know in the comments and I will get back to you as soon as possible and I just um, hope that you like this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and then have an amazing day I will see you in another video Bye.